So this is the print shop. Our print, my print shop. Um, right in front of this, walk in the front door, laminator. Got nowhere else to put it. Um, fits right there pretty well. Comes right off of the printer, goes here. Um, let's see what else we got. We have, uh, here's the Konica Minolta. We use that for brochures, uh, raffle tickets. Um, we print uh, four by seven advertising cards, things like that. Here's a bunch of media. We have some banner. Matt, I think this is 12 ounce. Some ink. Some stickers coming off the printer. These are going to be die cut. Back to the laminator. Then we have this piece of equipment. It's too heavy to move. It's still on the pallet. Used it twice. Bought it for a job. Never did that job. Just there it is. A cutter. This is probably the best thing I ever want. Used to cut banners, car decals, signs sometimes, just anything that needs to be done. This is a graph tech. This is what does all the die cuts on the stickers. Uh, this thing is probably biggest piece of equipment that gets the most use in here now. There's the table where everything's done. While we were moving in equipment the other day, I ripped my pedal off my laminator, have to repair that. Photo box, this is where we take all the photos of the stickers. We turn that on. So we'll take a sticker in here, prop it up in there. Got a sticker photo. Toolbox, uh, guillotine cutter. We used to use this thing on the floor. I broke it one day i was cutting way too much paper with it and uh now we have this this big thing again it's too heavy to move it just sits right there new label maker we just got or label printer we just got label finisher we don't know how to use any of it we don't know how to use this we know how to use this uh, this we still have to do training on uh, we got another computer over here we actually robbed this one from the laser because we really needed a computer over here and uh, not. We couldn't run cables from there all the way over there. Everything over here on this side is USB powered, except for that. But we just decided to keep it all to, to itself over here. Uh, refrigerator, restroom. Uh, back here we have uh, laser. This is where we robbed the computer from. This room is always a disaster. Uh, there's a chiller down there. Thanks, Mark. And uh, this is where trophies, plaques, pretty much anything cut with a laser gets done. And uh, that's it. We got a little rewinder here. Security footage. This is where all the security comes from, where we see the homeless people doing random stuff and measuring tapes vinyl we don't do a lot of cut vinyl a little here and there um, the flood actually got this piece right here and we tried to run this roll through that printer and broke it twelve hundred dollar service call from a wet roll of vinyl this is where the stickers go when we're done. So we have all these stickers, they get, all these stickers are laid out on this table. They get piled up in a pile. They get slapped on this table. They come over here. They get put in a little bag and they get shrink wrapped like this. I can't show you a lot of that stuff, but this is, uh, this is where we do it. There's the uh, trash can. We love our trash cans. That's a trash can for tubes. Trash can for trash. Let's see what else we got over here. So over here, we've got all these different types of media. This is a uh, gloss clear. Some half spent rolls. This is a uh, poster paper. This is a uh, five minute, no, this is a really cheap bright line wrap final. Um, this is five mil. We don't laminate that. That's for bottle labels till we get 
that over there up and running. Um, back over here, here we got a big old roll of this uh, holographic. There's some gloss laminate. I should probably throw that away. This is what we call rally vinyl. It's a low tack air release. Copier has a mouse that lives in it. You can hear it squeaking. And then that's it. Um, you wanna see how a sticker's made? Let's go over here to the computer. We'll go over here to Jesse. Jesse is a YouTuber. We do a lot of YouTube, a lot of YouTube stickers. So we'll take Jesse's sticker. I'll show you how a sticker's made. So let's take and uh, let's just undo all this. Let's see where it goes. So it comes in here like this. We go over here, we say we want it to be 3.5 inches. We can then zoom in on it. We go over here and we add a contour cut to it. We already figured out the contour cut. It's a little bigger than we like, but we figured out the contour cut for that. We add the cut. Now, she wants this on black, so we're gonna come in here, we're gonna do an outline. We have a 0.05 inch. It's red. She wants black, so we'll change that outline to black. Go out a page. Make sure our sizing is still right. It's a little wrong. Let's fix that. So three, 3.55. Now we're there. So we bring this down here. We don't really have to. And then we go over here and we print it. I decide how many we're gonna do. And then that goes over there. So we click send on that. Comes up to this here. There's the Epson, it prints. Go to the Graph Tech. And that's it. That's how quick they, uh, they come out. I think that's pretty much it for today. Next time I'll uh, maybe make some stickers. I think I'll do that with these. I'll show you how these pop out. We laminate. We got to change this to matte because I know that uh, Jesse wants matte. The job that comes after it's Matt, so we try to keep things together. We'll see you next time.